Well, if you love fall weather, today is the day that we have been waiting for and waiting for and waiting for since maybe <laughs> spring, April. <laughs> it has been a long time. You know, fall has been a little bit late this year. We've definitely seen a lot of days above normal. We've had a lot of days in the 90s this month, but that fall air finally did arrive overnight with that strong cold front. It came through dry, but our autumn temperatures are sticking around through the afternoon and then right into the weekend as well. We're even waking up to the 40s tomorrow morning, so if you thought this morning was chilly. It's going to be even chillier tomorrow morning. You're definitely going to want that extra layer, but the sunshine and the dry conditions, those are sticking with us as well. We could definitely use some rainfall, and unfortunately, we just have very meager chances as we head into next Monday. Most of us are not going to see a drop of rain for the next seven days, but look at this. Yesterday, we hit 93 degrees in the afternoon, and now we're sitting at 58 degrees, so you still need that light jacket more than likely if you're headed outside taking advantage of our fall weather. Our temperatures are running about 15 to 20 degrees cooler than this same time yesterday. So we're still seeing a lot of those upper 50s across the area, even 60 degrees in Corsicana, 58 in Bonham, 56 in Denton right now. We still have a little bit of a breeze, but the perfect place to celebrate autumn with autumn weather, that would be autumn at the Arboretum for Texas Town. I mean, look at these temperatures, 68 degrees by 4 o'clock, still feeling beautiful this evening. We're down to the lower 60s by 8 p.m., and we are looking at highs near 66 for Bowie, 68 in Waxahachie, 67 today in Greenville. This is a little bit below normal. So we went from well above normal temperatures to now below normal temperatures. And as we wake up tomorrow morning, we'll be running about 10 degrees cooler than average. We're looking at 46 degrees in DFW. Could even see some of those upper 30s along the Red River or in our outlying areas. So don't be surprised if you have that thermometer at home and you see the 30s. Yes, it is going to be pretty chilly, but our temperatures are warming up from here. Already by tomorrow, we'll have highs in the lower 70s. So here's tomorrow about 2 o'clock. We're at 68 degrees, 71 by 4 o'clock. We'll continue that full sunshine in the area. Our rain chances, as I mentioned, over the next seven days, there's not a lot of them where it's really going to be off to our northwest where we're going to see some of that heavier rainfall. And that's the system that we were hoping would actually make its way through North Texas. But it is going to stay off to the northwest for Friday, Saturday, even into Sunday, we might see a slight increase in cloud cover, especially Sunday evening into Monday as the system finally moves off to the northeast. And that's when we could see an isolated shower in North Texas. But most of us are just going to stay dry with temperatures that are warming up. And you can see that here in our first alert seven day forecast back to the lower 80s by Monday and then unfortunately Tuesday upper 80s. So in the meantime, let's just enjoy the stretch of 70s that we have through the rest of the week.